welcome back to One Crafty Ginger. I'm Mercedes, and this is Louise. Louise, say hi, princess. Yes, 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 you're my baby girl. You say hi. Show everybody say hello. She's being shy. What you doing, mamas? Come on, say hi. Say hi, I'm Louise. You don't want to look at the camera? Look at the camera, mama. Anyway, I thought it's been a hot minute since you guys have seen the girls, so I thought you guys might want to say hello to Louise today. There's my baby girl. There's my baby girl. Mwah. So anyway, if you enjoy quick and easy craft and DIY projects, clearance finds, thrift store flips, and some rescue dogs, then you're in the right place. Huh, mama? So today I have a super awesome jackpot, massive brand name makeup haul from Dollar Tree that I wanted to bring to you guys today so you could see all the goodies that I found and then hopefully find some goodies yourself. So should we get started, Louise? Yep, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get started. Sorry about that, Louise is getting a little bit wound up so I had to put her to bed, but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing her. So the first thing I wanna show you guys is this. Look, how impressive is that? Let me just bring it in close so you guys can see. And yes, you are reading that right. 120 colors. This is by Ver, V-E-R, Beauty. It is called Star Lush. I only found one. Let's open it up, shall we? So they have it nice and bubble wrapped. And then there's the palette. And then you can open it up. And I'm sure you're saying, Mercedes, there's, there's not 120 eyeshadows there. They cheated you. <laughs> no, they did not because Check it out, there's one underneath. How amazing is that, you guys? So you get the 120 colors. I'll bring it in again so you guys can see the amazing colors. Look at that. That is just it is impressive. So I looked it up online. So at the Vare Beauty website, which is their website, it is currently on sale for $8.99. It was $19.99, but it is marked down. So you can order it online if you want to for $8.99, which is still a pretty good deal for 120 eyeshadows. It does say on the back that it is cruelty free. Because, you know, I'm all about that cruelty-free life with my puppies. So, there is that. That was my biggest score. My, oh my goodness, I can't believe I found one. Because I don't get to find all the cool makeup stuff that most people find. Like, Marina finds awesome stuff in New York. And Mel and Megan find cool stuff in California. And I don't really find much here at all in Utah. Then, this also I found, it's, this is by City Color. It's called Pretty. I feel pretty, oh so pretty, I feel pretty and witty and bright, and I pity any girl that's not me tonight. What is that from? I'm a horrible singer. Don't mind my singing, but comment down below. Let me know if you know what musical that's from. So you open it up and check that out, guys. So you get eyeshadows here, eyeshadows there, highlighter, blush, and then contour and bronze. I'll bring it in close so you guys can see. I'm trying to get the glare off of there. There we go. How nifty is that? So this is like a do it all palette. Like you don't need anything really on here except for maybe some finishing powder and your uh, mascara, but everything else you get in there how cool is that and and they do have it plastic off so there is plastic over it so people don't get their grungy fingers in there super cool oh my goodness and the eyeshadow gods were just smiling upon me because there are more city color palettes 
So they had this set. This is called Obsessed. So there's that one there. I'm going to open them up so you guys can see because they don't look exactly like they do on the cover. So this is the cover. And that's what it looks like on the, on the inside. So there's number one. Here is number two, numero dos. And for those of you that are new, I do speak a little Spanish. Um, my maiden name, believe it or not, is Rivera. I don't look like a Rivera. My grandfather was Puerto Rican, but I guarantee you, I have I have Puerto Rican in there, I have Rivera in there. So my dad, my aunts, my grandparents all spoke fluent Spanish. I only speak enough to get me by. So there is number two. And then there is the inside. Look at how pretty that is, guys. So that is Obsessed number two. And then we have Obsessed number three. Sorry, I got a little wet there. My uh, Louise knocked over my water. So there is number three. Look at how pretty that is. And this one is my palette, so I will go ahead and do a little swatching. So it does have, look at that, oh, satisfaction peeling the plastic off. So let's see what we got. So this is the first one. Pretty good for one swatch. This is the second one. Which you can kind of see there. This one is the third right there. Ooh, I really like that one. So you have the first, second, and third. I'm running out of fingers here. Ooh, guys, look at that one. So that's the bottom right here. That's this one. And, oh, these are really pigmented, guys. I'll be honest, I wasn't sure, you know. Dollar Tree makeup, you never know. And then there is that middle brown. I'll have to switch over here. So this one here is that one there. So we'll do it over on this side. Ooh, mama, look at that one. Where did I leave off? And then that's this one here. Oh, wow, you guys, these, these are really nice. And then where else did we leave off? Oh, here's the, the creamy color in the middle. Can't really see that one because I'm, I'm pale. I'm a pasty redhead. Sorry guys. And then there's that like brick one right there. Didn't mean to give you guys the bird. And then there's the brick one. So yeah, you guys like look. Look at how pretty those are. So very nice. I would say definitely pretty pigmented. Should have brought a wipe. I have all right, I'll just have I'll have pretty fingers. <laughs> and then I also found Color Obsessed number four, which doesn't really tell you too much on the front. Ooh, Nelly, hot mama. Those are bright. I think these are gonna go in a giveaway because those are too bright for this girl. I like to keep things kind of neutral and not so brazen. And then here's Obsessed color number five. Oh, sorry. See about this one. All right, so this one's a little bit. I could do this one. That one's pretty too. So yeah, those are all eyeshadow. Oh, sorry. So if I do go give away, you guys might have a little bit of my eyeshadow fingers on these. Sorry. So yeah, so all of those were eyeshadows, which were amazing. And then to go with your eyes, they had the City Color B Batty Mascara. Now, I did try this out already. I want to give you guys a heads up. It is not waterproof. 
So if you want waterproof, this is not your jam. It will smudge if you rub your eyes. It will run if you cry. Just an FYI. So I thought I would show you guys, but it is it is a pretty good mascara, especially if you want something that's easy to remove at the end of the day. Because sometimes waterproof, you're just like scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing and you just can't get it off. So if you want something that's that's buildable and easy to remove at the end of the day, then this is definitely your jam. So here is the wand. And then I'm leaning. You guys are gonna get up close and personal here. So I didn't put any mascara on, so I could show you guys. And I am no beauty guru, so we're just gonna roll with it. Get closer, get closer, get closer. Okay, so there's that. None with, without. So it's pretty cool. You could, it's very buildable, which I like that you can, you can build it up. So you can kind of see a little bit more from there. So I, I think it's pretty good for $1.25. I'll be honest. I think it's a pretty good uh, mascara for a buck and a quarter. I mean, like I said, it's very buildable. It doesn't really clump too much. And like I said, it washes off really easily. You can see, oh my goodness, you guys like my gray hair. My gray hairs. Usually you don't see them because they blend in with my red, so I look strawberry blonde, but you can see the gray. And that's okay. I decided today, ladies and gentlemen, I am not old. I'm vintage. That's what we're going with now. I'm not old. I'm vintage. Anybody else out there vintage? Well, let me know down below. So yeah, so if you see that, I would recommend picking it up. I think it's a good deal for $1.25. And then also, like I said, these eyeshadow palettes for $1.25, they are very pigmented. I really like them. So yeah, super cool for that. And then we are not done, y'all. So we have the eyeshadows. We have the palettes. We have the mascara. I found, so this isn't brand name, but I did want to try this out. This is the Shea Butter Lipstick from the Ioni um, line that they have going on. What is this one? Where's it from? Sorry, my nose itches. Um, Shanghai. So I wanted to try this out so you guys and me, we can see like what the coverage is like because I never know. So this is a Shea Butter Lipstick and I love Shea Butter. I love Shea Butter. It's so great for like, it has so many uses. So I thought I'd give this a go so we can all see together what we're working with. So that's it opened up. That, that is the color there. So it does look like it has some color. Hmm. Not a lot of color. Actually really not any color at all. But... It does go on pretty smooth. You can kind of tell it's kind of buttery. So, doesn't really have any scent. It's kind of so. If you just want something like a like a lip balm to give you give, give your lips maybe a little bit of a a sheer look to it, it's okay. Not my favorite, but. That's why I thought I'd get it out so we could give it a go so you guys can know. Anyway, so moving on. Check it out. I found the masks. So this one is 24 karat purifying peel off mask with a wand to apply it, a spatula. I also found, I found a bunch. So if you need to like take a break, pause me, go get a drink, come back because we have a few things to get through to sing. And I found this Midnight Glow Peel Off Mask. So this one, I'm oh, sorry. So this one says purifies and renews skin. <coughs> and this one says restores and firms. This one is a Indian Healing Clay Mask. This one clears and brightens. I 
Um, I think I might try a clay mask. That sounds like something I could do. I don't know, peel off mask. I tried a peel off mask and I was like peeling it and I literally was crying because I was like, it hurt, it wouldn't come off my face. I ended up having to like try to scrub it off. It was a disaster. So your girl here does not do peel off mask, but the clay mask that you can like wash off might be my speed. This one is a blueberry mud mask, revives and brightens. Ooh, I like that. We're still not done, y'all. So this one is berry glowing peel off mask. Moisturizes, boosts radiance, fresh glow. And this one, oh my goodness, you guys look, it has sparkles and look, little stars. How fun is that? Super fun. And continuing with the sparkle, we have the Lily Shimmer Peel Off Mask. Smooths lines, radiant complexion, prevents dryness. So there you can see that one's all glittery and sparkly too. Shiny. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you guys watch Moana? You know what I'm talking about? The crab where he loves everything shiny. He's like, shiny. I love that. And, and then this one, this is pretty cool. So this one you get a pack of five peel off mass sets. So you get the gold, 24 golden glow, the cleanses purifying starlight, detoxifying silver glow, beauty beautifies lily shimmer and moisturizes berry glowing. Oh, so, and these masks are by a company called Vivo, V-I-V-O. And it says here, dermatological, dermatologic, I speak, dermatologist tested, paraben free, tested and approved USA, good manufacturing practice quality product. And then last but certainly not least, we have the Hemp Oil Power Squad Face Mask Collection. This you get the Freshens, Fresh Face Eucalyptus and Hemp Mask, Purifies Pure Clay and Hemp Mask, Detoxifying, Detoxifying Matcha and Hemp, Cleanses, Cleansing Berry and Hemp, and Brightens Illuminating Rose and Hemp. So yeah, how cool is that? Like these would make awesome gifts for gifting. I know, I know, it's only May, it's only May. But I keep a gift closet downstairs in my basement where I put bins of stuff in. So if people have like birthdays or Christmas or something, you can like, I keep some of these in there so I can grab them out and make little gift baskets. So, you know, like these would be awesome for gifting. Like you could do like one of these, you could do a candle, maybe some bubble bath, like a crossword puzzle and highlighter and have like a, like a relaxation, you know, um, relaxation night gift basket. Like how cute would that be? Maybe throw in like a blanket or something or one of those cute Dollar Tree like terry cloth headbands to like, you know, pull their hair back. Like that would be so cool and pretty much you can get all of that at the Dollar Tree and that would be such a fun little gift to give to somebody you know, especially for like their birthday or Mother's Day or whatever, because I would like that. I mean, I'm all for rejuvenation and relaxation and masking and crossword puzzles and cozy blankets and bubble baths and candles. That's That sounds pretty good to me. So anyway, guys, I appreciate you coming to spend some time with me today. Thank you so much. I'm sorry I've been MIA. Um, my mom came to visit last week, which you guys saw in my community tab. I posted a picture. So I was busy cleaning for a couple of days, so it was all clean when she got here and trying to run some last minute errands. And then we had Vintage Market Days, which y'all said that you wanted to see a haul of what I got from Vintage Market Days, so keep an eye out for that. That'll be coming um, in the next week or two. And I also got a super cool box of goodies from Maria over at Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict. So I will be doing a friend mail gifted Dollar Tree haul from her because she sent me some awesome stuff. And of course, I need to get back to crafting because that's what this channel was started for. So there will be crafts coming up. So definitely keep an eye out. You'll see all sorts of fun videos coming up over the next couple of weeks. Please comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item was that I found in this assortment, wonderful haul of goodiness, of awesomeness. Still can't believe I found it. 
Now it's probably going to be dry for a few months, but that's okay. I'll take a few. I'll take some awesome stuff and then wait a few months, take some awesome stuff. If that's what happens, I'm all for it. Also, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It's completely free. It helps your girl out. I appreciate it. And if you haven't already, smash that subscribe button. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much for coming by. I hope you have a marvelous weekend, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.